Well, all that weather perfect for the KXY4 Extreme Team. They're working hard on this season's Diamonds and Dreams Makeover, but there's still a lot of work ahead of them at AM Cannon Park. Let's check in with uh, Mark Peterson now for an update. Day two of the Extreme Team Hometown Chevy Diamonds and Dreams Makeover at AM Cannon Park. Team hard at work on a new backstop behind home plate. The old chain link fence, gone. We're replacing it with a unique, cool wooden backstop. Wayne Napla from Lance Pounder Excavators doing the prep work. This is a, back, a backstop for the baseball to hit. And <clears throat> we're just welding some brackets on here for the other guys to start putting it together. And I know we've been talking a lot about the baseball field, but guess what? Yep, there's even more to this makeover. Today, the tennis court. It's cracked full of weeds, not anymore. Guys from actually loading, clearing the court, resealing it. We're getting ready to burn all the cracks out, burn them, clean them out. Um, we grind them out and get them prepped so they can actually play tennis on the court. And everybody walking through the park already looking forward to all the changes, including, of course, the new snack shack. Do you know what they're going to have there? Yeah. Some peanuts and crackers? Some Maybe some pop? soda pop? Yeah. Yeah. Pretty cool and very excited about what's coming to the park. Now, here's a couple things happening. Specialty Mobile Ready Mix is going to be here bright and early 6 a.m. We're going to start pouring some stuff. But take a look at what we've already done with the field. Uh, there's that backstop we showed you. It's finished. And then Nick with the Lance Pounder Excavation came in and in an hour tuned up this field. It's getting ready for uh, more fill dirt. And then... CDA structure still working on the snack shack and here is where the dugout's going to be and that northwest fence is coming in they're going to do the fencing we're going to pour tomorrow Dundee concrete is going to come in they're going to get the forms put in and then we're going to pour so we're got a very busy morning tomorrow and it's going to take us all the way up through noon just to get the concrete done the other cool part about this northwest spray foam is coming in Tyler and his crew tomorrow morning 5 a.m. and the snack shack is going to get coated inside that's going to firm up all the walls and it's going to keep it cool and warm depending on the season could be pretty neat so uh, Mountain States Electrical got it all uh, electrified got cleared with our permit and so now we'll do the underground tomorrow and that's the plug-in for those who are blind and that's going to be the audio cable Nadine well the good news Mark as you know weather's going to be great tomorrow so you're going to get a lot yeah. done all right thanks so much